All right, maybe you've noticed this summer, mosquitoes are out in full force in Colorado, eating us alive. And just so you know, the state is keeping tabs on them to try to save lives. Denver 7's Lance Hernandez got an inside look at the people tracking the West Nile virus. Knowing that a mosquito took my father down, it's horrible. Rose Gallegos promised her father that she would warn people about West Nile. And it was brutal. Her father, Jesse, contracted encephalitis after getting bitten by a mosquito on his foot back in 2008. He became paralyzed and died five years later. Deep inside the state health department's labs at Lowry, technicians are busy testing vials full of mosquitoes for West Nile. These come from different counties in Colorado. Lab techs add saline to the vials, shake them up, and place them in a centrifuge. Once separated into liquids and solids, they get answers that could save lives. Any West Nile that's in the sample will be in this liquid. So far this season, only one case of West Nile has been reported in Colorado. That patient contracted the virus out of state. None of the mosquitoes have tested positive at the state labs, but some did test positive at a lab in Pueblo. The beauty of that testing is that we were able to identify the West Nile virus prior to humans becoming ill. The first thing that we do is get the word out so that people can take uh, personal responsibility to protect themselves. Scientific lab director Emily Travanti says they also partner with mosquito control districts to determine whether to spray or whether to treat ponds. Now with our wet spring, are we more at risk of West Nile? Unfortunately, we really cannot predict um, what kind of season we're gonna have in terms of human illness. Dr. Jennifer House says one in five victims will experience symptoms, aches, pain, and chills. 10% of those will get the neuroinvasive disease. Gallego says that's why it's important to wear long sleeves and slacks at dusk and dawn and to use DEET until the first freeze. Lance Hernandez, Denver 7.